Salutations and other forms of greetings and pleasantries. Welcome to more Let's Play, um, Dynamite Heady Blind. Okay, in the last one, uh, we fought... I don't even know what the, uh, you know, part of me wants to be like, oh, it's the most frustrating boss so far, but it's like, you know what, a lot of the boss have been frustrating, so who can say? Oh man, Heady the Hero? Oh, that sign's rooting for me. Oh man, this is gonna be like an action platformer. Oh, excuse me, boss. What did that do? Do I have to hit him in his uh, big dumb bear head? He sort of looks like a bear. He kind of looks like a cat. Oh no. Okay. How the hell do you not die right there? Huh. Huh. Wow. Can you imagine if that was like your attempt? That made you like start the whole game over? Like, like that was your that was your attempt. You're like, all right, I'm on my last life. Can I pull out the clutch? And then that BS happens. You're like, nope, back to level one. Yeah, if it weren't for save states, I would not have put up with this game enough to finish it. Not because it's a bad game, but it's freaking brutal, man. To have the the go back to level one with the difficulty being like this, I mean, that's too much, man. That's expecting too much from like the average player. I wasn't trying to, I was just trying to not die. Okay, so we should be on the right side for the first part. Okay. Okay, so you can actually be in the spike quite a bit, actually, without getting actually hurt. Can I only hit the boober thing when it's glowing? Do I have to hit the thing that he shoots? Oh, by the way, I did notice this. I think it's pretty cool, actually, how the... Um, the bonus points have little, like, propellers, like, holding them up or whatever. I know they're not spinning fast enough to actually propel it up. But I do think that that's a nice little touch that they added. You'd be like, well, how are the points just floating in midair? It's like, no, there's a propeller. Okay, so what does F SF stand for? I wonder. I do think it's funny how they have a treasure and Sega logo. Yeah, so I can't throw down. I can't throw the head down through the thing. So I have to wait for him to poke something up through that I can hit. Do I have to... Okay, let's go to the right side. Maybe you get the secret bonus point because it's like harder. No, I got the bonus point there too. I feel like it's hard to not get it actually. Do I just have to survive till the end, I wonder? Maybe we... Oh, what the hell? How... What? What hit me right there? Okay, so I'm pretty sure you actually have to jump. Oh, okay. Maybe we maybe you have to do the uh the uh, the platform sequence and then when we get to the top then we'll fight him where we can actually damage him. Cuz I'm assuming this is like the final boss. I mean, there's 8 I know that there's like 8 worlds and we're on like 8 6 or something. Oh wait, no. We're on C91. Huh. But there was five parts to world 8, so I thought that that was going to be the end. Okay. Man, this is gonna suck, ain't it? I feel like two auto scroll bosses back to back is a little bit too much, you know? What is the point of those? What do those do? I feel like this first, like this first part doesn't even need to exist. Oh, you can't uh, shoot the things up when the dude's standing on it. Okay, when the 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 cookie man or whatever is on it. I feel like the first little section of that is just to kill time. Okay, so if you jump and you miss, you just have to like jump again. Why well, didn't I felt like it by that time I had landed? It, I felt like it was too low. I felt like I was gonna hit the spike, but I guess you can. I, I guess I did already say this. You can go kind of deep into the uh, spike without actually getting hurt. Oh, maybe I should save state like midway through this. Otherwise, it takes a long time to do like one attempt. What do these do? All right, cool. I feel like, the, like, what's the point of those? I don't know what I was expecting. I just had no idea. I just want to find out. Yeah, I think I might have to save state partway through this. Okay, this section again. This is only like the, what, second or third time I've been past this part? Why can't I hit him in the head? Do I have to do something with that ball of energy that he shoots? 
And why are there points? Why are they giving me points during a boss fight? Maybe you do just have to survive. Uh, Mini, what's gonna be best one? I have no idea what that means. Oh man, the thing is like changing speeds. Okay, let's try to not get crushed. Oh man, two one man? Oh man. I can only get one though. Okay. Oh man, that was close. Uh, okay, so we're at the top. We didn't made it. Am I gonna be able to change heads back? I don't want to be this head. I'm so slow. Really? You don't get to heal or anything? Oh wait, I'm not controlling this. What's he doing? What is going on? I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Hey Heather, why don't you help me out? It looks like he's got like a like a ball sack. That's like dangling and twisting. So what actually happened? I didn't destroy the machine, why is it blowing up? What happened to it? Are we gonna like put our differences aside? And escape together or something? Wow, he actually grabs onto you, son of a bitch. Okay, well, uh, do I have an extra life? Oh wait, I grabbed one, so I have one, right? Oh wait, you know what, let's save over, um... Oh wait, this one's way far back. Let's save over this one. Okay, it'd be nice if they, uh, hooked a ninja up with some nanners. Wow, I actually have to shake him off. Okay, I... I got a banana from somewhere, I didn't see it, did it come on screen? Wow. Can I hit him to keep him from doing that? Oh man, another auto scroll boss. I don't think I, I think maybe I just have to survive. I'm assuming I don't actually have to blow it up. Yeah, it doesn't have a health. Well, just cause it doesn't have a health meter doesn't mean that I'm not necessarily supposed to not kill it. Or you know what I mean, right? Did I say that backwards? Don't run. But I have to, I want to. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, the, the nanner's just uh, hanging out right there. Okay, let's uh, lock this one. Okay, so I have to, I have to, I think I have to hit B to actually shake him off. Cause I hit, I hit C a bunch of times, it didn't work. I had like no freaking health. Uh, I kind of don't want to um use my um like use my last life. I'm guessing this isn't. Th this is probably still not the final boss. No, get away! Let's dodge lasers and dodge him. Jeez. I can't hit him until he grabs on onto me. Why would he want to grab onto me? Like he like it slows both of us down when he grabs onto me. So why would he why would he do that? That's not a good uh, tactic to help us escape. Oh man, jumped right into that. Oh, I thought it was the end because he stopped moving. Oh, son of a. Ugh. All right, I want to try to do this without uh, using that life, but I might need to. And what does SF stand for? Okay, I think he does actually... How are you supposed to dodge, man? You just have to keep moving and then you won't get hit most of the time? Is that the idea? Okay, so it seems like he shoots in one direction several times, and he shoots another in another direction several times. Oh man, I was actually holding. It seems like you actually run to the right faster than you run. You run to the right faster than you run to the left. That makes no sense. You would think that it would be the exact opposite. Oh man, did you see those dodges? That's something I'm not going to be able to repli uh, replicate. Oh man, I, I hit down to duck. Turns out you can't duck, but it still somehow missed me. 
No, come on. I need another freaking banana, man. Oh, why can't there be another banana? Do you see how long I lasted? I'll try a few more times. I might have to just take that uh, death or whatever. I really don't want to, though. And I lasted a long time. So I feel like I might be able to do it. Then again, some of those dodges I might not be able to replicate. You know what? When he jumps on you, you only get stunned for a moment. I feel like maybe prioritizing dodging the lasers might be a better use of my attention. Oh, what the frick? Oh, come on. What were we supposed to do there? Am I supposed to be hitting him, I wonder? Do I have to hit the core thing at the top? I guess I should rule that out before I try surviving for for like five minutes just to realize that it goes on forever. And why is it called Far Trek? I feel like that's a little bit of a stretch. That's not a very good uh it's not a very good pun. Which don't get me wrong, I do like puns, but there is a point. I mean I even like corny puns, but there there is a there is a, there is a cutoff. For me it's not it's the line isn't the line isn't like very far but like the the one main pun that I don't like is when you say that something is punny instead of funny it's like come on really it's like well you don't like corny puns no I do like corny puns I just don't like that one I don't I don't like it when they're that corny that's like too corny man see I like it I like it when it's like just corny enough you know I thought maybe I had to Hit it and it's dangling uh, key balls. Wow. I am dead again. I might just have to show this successful attempt. Oh my god. Did you see that dodge? Jesus Christ. Dude, this level goes on for freaking ever. Oh wait, dude, stop coming after me. Does that mean we. What does that mean? What? What does that mean, though? It sucks that you can't jump over two laser beams. You can't jump over two laser beams, and you can't jump in between. You can't jump over one laser beam and then jump over a second one. It's Bootsy, man. I feel like they're expecting a lot, given the physics of this game, you know? Okay, this is new. I don't exactly know what's happening. I gotta somehow... Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm one hit from dying. Oh, wouldn't it be nice if something good happened? Also, something I also didn't mention that I noticed uh, very much so is that it's super hard to... Um, a finale analysis? I do have two lives, though. Oh, my God. 
Uh, I, it's freaking like having all the shit passing by in the foreground is like one more layer of um, it's like one more layer of reason why it's hard to dodge the things. Um, okay, so because I have an extra life, I'm probably just gonna take a death and then uh, and then save. This is a cool looking boss. I like the uh, I like the happy face uh, thing on him. Oh no! Eh. Are we gonna like defeat him and he's gonna break out and save us or something like uh, like in Mega Man X? Yeah, spoilers for Mega Man X. Uh, okay, I am dead. Uh, okay, so in the next one, we will uh, fight that guy. I thought that um, I thought that that last level was gonna be, or the one with the claw dude or whatever was gonna be the final boss. I guess not. This has final boss written all over it. Um, so is this like the dude who is controlling the the bad bear guy or whatever? Is that is it kind of like a King DDD situation where King DDD is actually? Wait, what is the deal? He's actually not evil, right? There's always some kind of force that corrupts him, and then that's why uh, he was the villain in a, in several other Kirby games, right? Um, is that what's happening here? Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. So, um, yeah, get ready for a incredibly long uh, boss fight consisting of 17,000 attempts um, in the next one. And as always, thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. Take care. Bye.